Hi, my name is Nicole Angeline. Welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm going to show you how to make one of my favorite recipes, my classy cream cheese salmon napoleon. This only takes a few ingredients, doesn't take long at all to make. It's great to make at home with your kids, or if you really want to impress someone, this is a very classy appetizer. So here are our basic ingredients. We have smoked salmon, sliced, Philadelphia cream cheese at room temperature, Creme fraiche, which is similar to a sour cream, but it's creamier and richer. And you can usually find it in specialty grocery stores in the dairy aisle. If you can't find it, you can substitute sour cream. I've gone ahead and mixed in some softened cream cheese, about two ounces to the four ounces of creme fraiche. So that's mixed together. Then we have some beautiful fresh avocado, tomato, green onions, and then for our topper, we have wonton crisp. Now you can find these in most grocery stores in the produce section. They're great to top off this appetizer. And I usually use the ginger garlic flavor. You can use whatever you okay, like. So what we're going to do first is we're going to mix the sliced smoked salmon with our cubed room temperature cream cheese. And just mix it for just a couple seconds in a food processor. consistency of like a salmon spread. Oh, that looks so good. Can you see how yummy that looks? Delicious. So, it's going to be nice and creamy, perfect for our Napoleon. And that, my friends, is all there is to it. Now we just have to fill our glass. So, I like to use goblets, sometimes martini glasses, something decorative and fun. Okay, so now we're going to assemble, and this is the fun part. We're going to start out with our creme fraiche at the bottom. And this is creme fraiche that's been mixed with some room temperature cream cheese. Now for if you're doing four total of the Napoleons, you want to use about four ounces of creme fraiche to two ounces of softened cream cheese. And just mix them together in a nice, rich, velvety consistency. So, in your goblet or martini glass, whatever you're going to use here, just do a spoonful, maybe two, of the creme fraiche mixture. Then we're going to top it with the delicious smoked salmon spread. This is making my mouth water. <laughs> okay. And we're just going to spread that around right on top of that creme fraiche. do some avocados and these are just cubed and because I've already cut them I mix them with some lemon juice so they wouldn't brown. Okay, some beautiful red tomato on top of that and then some more smoked salmon. So you can never have too much smoked salmon and cream cheese, right? Okay, and finally, we're going to top that smoked salmon off with a little bit more creme fraiche. Just spread it around. You can do a dollop or you can kind of spread it around and put a tablespoon or so on there. Then we're going to garnish it with our green onions, chopped green onions, and our crispy wonton strips. These are garlic and ginger. And that is it. Those are our smoked salmon cream cheese napoleons. Okay, here is our classy cream cheese salmon napoleons. These are in goblets. And this is a beautiful appetizer. This would be great to impress your mother-in-law or your boss if they come over for dinner. And then over here we have our more fun version in our martini glasses. This is if the girls stop by. Maybe you're doing dinner and a movie at home and you want to make a fun appetizer with the girls. This will be great. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy my Napoleons as much as I do. That cream cheese
and cream pressed with the smoked salmon. This is heaven. You have to try this.